Tetsuo gets his psychic powers, it reminded me of Andrew from the 2012 Seattle film Chronicle. Now that is another masterpiece. Chronicle is a, well, it's a high school film that stars Michael B. Jordan from the Creed and Black Panther. Um, anyways, he, uh, he and a group of friends all of a sudden develop superpowers. But one of his friends ends up using it for the bad reasons. And it was exactly like Akira. And why do I say exactly like? Because, okay, this is the only spoiler I'm, getting, I'm going to give for you. Tetsuo goes bananas. Beyond bananas. <laughs> he basically destroys a whole bridge. That's all I want to say. That's the spoiler that you're going to get. So, you have been warned. Or you have been spoiled. <laughs> um, it is one of the most original films I've ever seen. I, you know, and I most of the films that I watch, they are original. But other films, like when it comes to psychic powers, they rip it. They, they're a complete ripoff. I would be absolutely horrified if they remade this movie, because Akira is, well, like I say, a masterpiece. No one should ever remake a masterpiece. Well, okay, Disney did, but this movie is not owned by Disney. If um, if they were to redub this, like I said, you get J.K. Simmons to be to play the Colonel, and you could also get names like I don't know some of the cast members from Rick and Morty, like Spencer Grammer, maybe even her father Kelsey Grammer to do some of the characters in this story. That would be cool. But anyway, Akira is very well done well written memorable and here's the thing some movies that i watch you just know in your heart that it is going to be a great movie it's like you feel great you feel confident the minute i pushed play i knew i was in for an adventure plus i saw some clips from watch mojo and all i could say was I'm glad I rented it. Finally, I can think about some characters to play at Comic-Con or Odafest, and that's that. I will rate Akira 10 out of 10 film cameras. Very well done. Well, vo Very well done with the voice acting, the script. The whole movie is a masterpiece, and it is now one of my all-time favorite movies of the 1980s. But keep in mind, this is not for kids. Spirited Away is for kids.